Hi, this is George again from eAccess Tech Support. I just wanted to go over some of the features that we talk about. One of these are some of the most common questions we get regarding BlackBerry messages and the message settings. So we're going to start off by looking at the messaging application on your BlackBerry. We're going to click the menu key and type the letter O and go to options. So we're within message options. The first thing we're going to look at is general options. And you'll notice here at the top here, there's different things you can display in your email list, such as time or name or subject and so on. And you have several options. These are not really critical. It's kind of a question of whatever you like to see and how much information you can display. The really critical one here is where it says hide filed messages. By default, it says no, but we're going to change that to yes. That's very important because if you file a message or delete a message or move a message to a folder, things like that, you really want those messages to disappear from your inbox on your BlackBerry. So by setting this to yes, they will in fact disappear. If you don't have that set to yes, you'll find that those messages, even though you file them, still appear to be there and people often complain about that. The next one here is hide sent messages. And um, this is kind of optional. Some people like to see their sent messages, some people don't. So this is purely up to you whether you like to see those sent messages in your BlackBerry listing or not. Um, there's also an option for SMS and email inboxes. The default is theme controlled, but you can either combine them, meaning all your messages and your text messages will be in the same folder in the same inbox, or you can set them to separate, which means you'll have a separate icon for your SMS text messages. Finally, um, there's some other options like auto more. That means that as you're reading or scrolling through a long email, the BlackBerry will automatically scroll and pull in more of the message. So again, we recommend making that yes. So we're gonna go ahead and just click the menu and save those changes that we just made. The next thing we wanna look at is at email settings here. Um, again, typically you're gonna say send email to handheld, save copy in the sent folder. And a feature that a lot of people are not aware of is something called auto signature. By changing that to yes, you can actually put your name, your phone number, whatever other information you wanna display on your email and this information, including this sent using BlackBerry or whatever you choose to use, will appear at the bottom of all of your email messages. So again, this is very important to do. We'll skip email filters. We'll go to email reconciliation. The default is default delete on handheld. What I really recommend is delete on mailbox and handheld. This way, when you delete a message on your BlackBerry, if you're set up to synchronize it, we'll also delete that message in your Outlook or whatever email source you're using or your Yahoo account or whatever type of email um, that is uh, being supported. Another popular option is prompt. What that would mean is that if you delete a message on your BlackBerry, it will prompt whether you want to delete that on your uh, email source, like your Outlook or, or Lotus Notes or whatever you're using. Wireless Reconcile should be on and on conflicts, Mailbox wins which means your email source, like your Outlook, your Office copy, will actually win over the BlackBerry. So that's what we generally recommend. Uh, we'll go ahead and save those changes. The last thing you want to do is after you've done these changes, you want to click the menu key, type the letter O, and uh, I'm sorry, type the letter R, excuse me, and you want to choose Reconcile Now. That will cause the BlackBerry to synchronize with your message source so that those messages that have been deleted or moved or copied or filed or whatever will appear the same way in your BlackBerry as they do in your message source. So again, these were some quick tips about how to set up your message options on your BlackBerry device. For more information, please visit www.eaccess.com or www.wirelessbyeaccess.com.